design a Turing machine for L is equal to W C W where W belongs to A B star which means that it can accept any number of A's and B's. Now let us consider W to be A A B. Now the string which has been accepted by this machine will be A A B C A A B. Okay. Now let us see how it works. Now in the tape I have the string as like this. Okay. Now B is the blank space that is present in the tape. Okay. Now in the beginning the tape header remains here. In the beginning the tape header remains here. Now the first the tape has encountered an A. Once it has encountered an A, this A is replaced by X. This A is replaced by X and the tape header moves right. Okay, and the tape header moves right. Now, my string will look like this. Now my string will look like this. Now when the tape, tape header moves right, it will move right until it encounters this C. Until it encounters this C. Once it encounters this C, it moves to the next. It moves to the next and checks out whether it has the same A which it replaced before. If it is so, this A is replaced by E. X. This A is replaced by X. So now my string will be like this. Now once it has been replaced by X, the tape header will move left. The tape header will move left and it crosses C and then it has to encounter the first X. Once it has encountered the X, it moves to the right. It moves to the right. Now here it encounters an A and this A is replaced by X. This A is replaced by X. So now my string will remain like this. Now. After replacing this A by X, my string will move towards right. After crossing C, it will check out if it comes across any A's and B's. Now, if it comes across an A, it will check out with whether this A is Similar, this A is same as that of that which it replaced before. Which it replaced before. If it is so, this A is replaced by X. This A is replaced by X and now my string will look like this. Now, after replacing this by X, the tape header will move left. The tape header will move left and it will cross out this C and en <coughs> moves till it encounters the first X. After it encounters the first X, it will move right. It will move right and check out what encounters. If it encounters a B, this B is changed as Y. This B is replaced by Y. Okay, now my string will look like this. Now, after replacing, this tape header will move right. Once it crosses C, it will go for encountering A or B. So, when it crosses this X, this X and comes here, it comes across this B. Now, it checks out whether this B is same as that which it replaced before. If it is so, this is again replaced by Y. If it is so, it is again replaced by Y. And now my string will look like this.
okay now after replacing this tape header will move towards left when it moves towards left when it crosses this c it checks out whether it encounters an a or b if it does not so then it will move towards right it will move towards right and checks out after this why it encounters a blank space after this it encounters a blank space if it encounters a blank space then it means that both the strings are same it is an accepted string now we are going to build a turing machine for this okay we are going to design now first q0 is the initial state q0 is the initial state in the initial state this q not can accept either a or b whatever it might be so it can accept a or it can accept b also so when it accepts a this a is replaced by x and it moves right when it is b it is replaced by y and it moves right now we'll consider this situation and then we'll come for this so when it accepts when it encounters an a it is replaced by x and it moves right okay then it moves right right and it can come across any number of a's and b's so here it can come across any number of a's any number of b's so even though when it comes across any number of a's and any number of b's it will move right it will move right so now it has to encounter a c so it has to encounter a c so when it encounters a c this c is kept as such and it will move right and it will move right so now it comes to the next state q2 okay now when it reaches right it checks out for a it checks out for a that is the a which it has replaced before it checks out for that particular a if it is so then that a is replaced by x and now my header will move left so it moves left so now this is q3 now at this stage when it encounters c and it with starts moving right see when you consider this situation when it encounters a c and when it moves right it can encounter any number of x any number of y's so there across comes across a situation where it can come across any number of x it can comes across any number of y it will move it will move right okay until it gets this a or b whatever it might be so if it reaches a it is replaced by x and it will move start moving left so when it starts moving left after replacing after replacing either here or here wherever it might be after replacing my header will move left my header will move left so while moving left it can come across any number of x and it can come across any number of y even though it comes across any number of x and any number of y it will move left so in this state it can come across any number of x it can come across any number of y it will move left it will move left now this process continues this moving left process continues until it encounters a c so it until it encounters a c so this re c remains as such and again it further it moves left further it moves left now while moving left after crossing c while moving left after crossing c it can come across any number of a's any number of b's so if it comes across any number of b a's and b's never mind it will move left until it reaches the x which has which it has 
altered until it reaches the x which is as altered so when it encounters the x it starts moving right so when it starts moving right it can encounter an a or it can encounter a b so when it encounters a the same process goes on now when it encounters b b is replaced by y and then it moves right now it moves to the next state it is q5 so once it has encountered b after that it can encounter any number of a's any number of b's it moves right so after this it goes in search for c so when it encounters a c it moves right which comes to the next state q6 okay now after encountering this c it it can come across any number of x any number of y when it goes in search of this b so it can come across any number of x any number of y so it will move right okay now after this it will search for a or b now it will go for searching this b which it has been replaced if it finds that b that b is replaced by y and it starts moving left if it uh, finds that b that b is replaced by y and it starts moving left so once it moves left so once it moves left it can encounter any number of x and any number of y never mind it will move left so it can encounter any number of x any number of y it will move left okay now it goes in search for c it goes in search for c now so once it comes across this c it moves left it moves left this is the next state when it reaches c now after this c it will go in search for this y which it has been uh, replaced which it has been replaced now while searching it can come across any number of a's any number of b's never mind it will move left now it will go in search for b which it has been altered as y now once it encounters this y once it encounters this y it moves to the once it encounters this y it moves to right so from that right it can accept a it can accept b and the same process goes on again and again until it reaches a blank space after x and y so after reaching y it starts moving right so at that place it may accept an a or b if it is not so if there is no a and there is no b it goes for considering the c it goes for considering the c so when it considers this c it starts moving after encountering this c it starts moving right so when it starts moving right it reaches this q9 at this state after encountering c it can come across any number of x or any number of y it starts moving right then after this x and y it has to encounter a blank space to reach the next state which is the accepted state so that is what is given here so when it comes across y it should move right it should cross the c and then it should move it should come across x and y and then it should reach this blank space when it encounters a blank space after x and y the string becomes accepted